Hey everyone, welcome to Crest TV. Uh, my favourite episode today because it's an exclusive, an exclusive product announcement. I think this is like the biggest product announcement since I've been here at Crestron over a year now. Um, so I've got our director of product marketing, Lauren Simmons, uh, to help me with this exclusive. Lauren, good morning. Good morning, Neil. How are you? I'm very good. So I uh, drum rolls and, you know, clickbaity, you know, this is we've just been live at Enterprise Connect uh, with Microsoft. So uh, I'm guessing people have seen that announcement for those that have been sleeping in a darkened room and didn't see the Microsoft main stage announcement about what we're talking about today. What are we announcing today? What's it all about? So I'm so excited to be able to bring this to you today because it has been uh, it's been a lot of fun. It's been a lot of work, um, but we're so excited. So for those of you who missed the uh, exclusive, um, I'm sorry, the Enterprise Connect keynote uh, that was done by Microsoft just a few minutes ago, um, there's some really exciting news coming to the Air Media product line. So for those of you who don't know what Air Media is, it is the uh, wireless conferencing and presentation solutions that we have at Crestron. Today, what was announced on stage at Enterprise Connect is we are bringing wireless conferencing to the Air Media Connect adapter. Uh, so our little um, plug and play adapter there. So we're bringing wireless conferencing to that. And you know, Neil's got it right there. Um, and what was announced on stage with Microsoft is that we are partnering with Microsoft to actually bring a crush on Air Media Teams combined solution to the market. That's so awesome. I'm gonna say that again, right? We're bringing BYOD and teams to the market together with Microsoft um, to really embrace all of these new spaces that are coming up. But there's a lot going on there. So let's let's try and un unpick some of this stuff. So uh, Air Media has been, it's not a new product. It's been around since like 2012. And typically, you know, when you think Air Media, you kind of think AirPlay and Miracast, wireless content sharing. And you come into your room with your iPhone, your iPad or your laptop, do Windows and I or P or whatever it is. And you can then wirelessly share from your laptop to the screen now more recently uh, this year well, there's a video on it on uh, on on tinternet um, we announced the wireless conferencing so that then adds the ability to have um, the webcam that's can you can plug a usb camera into the air media behind the big telly and then wirelessly you can then not only share your desktop you can then share the um, camera but now for those people that don't like wireless and like a and a <laughs> old-fashioned you know i like a cable that plugs in the side this this bit does the same thing does everything it it does um and it actually makes the workflow a lot simpler so you mentioned right. miracast you mentioned airplay that's a driver or an, that's an application that you have to download right you have to have that application available on your your computer to be able to go and make those presentations not the end of the world, um, but with the Air Media Connect adapter, we can make the workflow much, much simpler. Nice. It is literally plug in and push the button on the side there, and you are presenting or you are conferencing. And what's really exciting about this unit here is that it is a it is what we call appless. There is no application, there is no driver that needs to be downloaded. So it doesn't your computer doesn't look at it as a storage device. So therefore, when you plug it in, it recognizes it as an as an extended display which means that there is nothing to download. There's nothing to add to your computer. When you have guest presenters, or if you have you know, big security lockdowns on your laptop, you can't download stuff from external sources, I have those. which I had at my previous company. <laughs> yeah, I have those um, all the time. <laughs> this eliminates those requirements. So it is truly plug, play, and, and you're done. Okay, now again, I, you, I'm gonna just rewind you a sec, because I. The dongles like this have been around from competitors and typically you have to press the button you put it in it comes with like a flash drive on your laptop and you do have to kind of click an executable there's like an auto run when you plug it in um and uh, i'm just gonna lose the dog um live uh you, you have to um you have to plug it in uh, and then it kind of comes up with like a hard drive you double click on an executable and then it, it fires up uh and then there's like an app running in the background we sneakily got some app in the background or is it truly no it is it's truly if you think about when you do a dual monitor or if you plug it an hdmi from a monitor into your laptop your laptop goes oh look there's another screen recognized what do you want to do nice um and that's the same thing with this uh so because it, there is no executable there is no driver your computer looks at it just like it would any extended display Wow. Um, so you don't have those executables. You don't have to go and download something. You don't have to do a whole bunch of other steps. You can 
just plug it in and it recognizes it as another display. Beautiful. And again, there's going to be a Teams version. You can push the button and it will launch Teams, bring Teams to the foreground so you don't have to go and hunt down your window to find Teams. If you want to share something, bang, you hit it, you're in Teams and it shares and, and that's all good. But that and that's what we announced. But this is this is coming. This is going to be shipping. This version here that I've got in my hand, this is shipping, uh, I want to say April. That will be shipping in April. April. Wow. Okay. Well, that's not long away. Uh, beginning or April? Nope. Let's put you on the spot. Come on. <laughs> uh, probably right in the middle there. Right in the um, middle. We've got all the hard work. <laughs> we've got all the hard work coming in. Um, we're putting the, fun, the finishing touches on, on a few things, and then those will be shipping out the door. They are orderable now. Very um, cool. I want to go back, Neil. You, you said something about the Teams thing, and Ilya was on stage not long ago. Uh, actually doing a live demonstration of this, uh, which was super exciting. Um, so the, as you mentioned, right, the Teams version of this will have a Teams uh, button on the front of it. Mm -hmm. And what that's going to do is just like a one-touch join meeting for that everyone's used to with, my, with MTRs and Microsoft Teams rooms. Um, it's going to launch that desktop application of Teams, which means that it is going to be, you know, that one-touch join that everybody's used to experiencing with MTRs, just now in the BYOD space. So we're really excited for that. Um, that'll be coming later in the year. But as Neil, you know, we just talked about that that dongle or that Airmeet Connect adapter is available in April, shipping in April. You order it today, um, and uh, there is stock, right? So Air Media, which is as you said before, is available. Uh, it's mm -hmm. been out for about a year or so, year and a half. Um, it's available. You know, you can put an order in today, and it's going to ship this week. So. Um, uh, we're we're really excited about that. All the all the fud about uh, no stock. So this will be in stock and shipping in April. Now again, let's uh, just make sure we we clarify a couple of things. So if I bought an Air Media from a while back, uh, I won't say from 2012, but this is you can retrofit this. You can add this as an add-on to existing Air Media customers. This isn't just net new customers. If you've already got Air Media, you can go and buy these as just an accessory and plug those in and, and hook those up. Correct. I'm going to make one clarification because it's not compatible to units from 2012. That was the, <laughs> yeah. this is, so this generation is now My the third iPhone generation. My iPhone from 2012 is not compatible with today. <laughs> Just want to clarify yeah, out yeah. there. Um, so there are three generations of Air Media. Yeah. Uh, the third generation is what we released um, in August, I think of 2021. Mm -hmm. uh, so those are the Air Media devices. There are the AM30, uh, 3000, 3100, 3200 and we have wi-fi and non-wi-fi versions as well Sweet. so anything with the am 3x00 mm -hmm. is what those teams units are compatible with but most people have upgraded um over the last you know 18 months or so to the new air media solution because it just brings a whole lot more functionality but if you've got one of those new uh third generation air medias go take the connect and it will work with your existing product i love it i love it and uh Talk to me about the wireless conferencing now. So we talked about, the, the, obviously, you plug this in, it becomes a display. But again, Microsoft seems to be softening a little bit to BYOD, um, you know, with regards to, you know, coming in with your laptop and running the Teams application using the front of room camera um, that you connect up to your Air Media. And again, rather than having to run USB cables under the floor, back to the table and things like that, which... Again, Crestron has some great extenders uh, if people want to do that. But if you don't want to have to run, if you've got a concrete floor, you don't want to run those cables, you can plug one of these into your laptop and suddenly that that camera, that you know, Jabra Panacast or Hadley IQ, whatever it might be that you've got at the front of the room connected to the Air Media, magically connects via this dongle to your laptop. Now, I'm assuming that that requires some software if you want to do the camera thing. Uh Yes, it requires the Air Media receiver. Yeah. So the units that I mentioned before, the AM 3000, 3100, and 3200, um, those devices sit behind the display. They've got uh, the HDMI ingest. They've got the ability to connect to those peripherals that you're talking about, whether it's cameras, microphones, speakers, things like that. That device is where the Air Media says, okay, yep, I've got now control of all of the peripherals in the room for conferencing. And that's kind of where the magic happens is, is in that box that lives behind the display. The Air Media Connect adapter that you've got there creates a Wi-Fi network between itself and the receiver at the behind the TV. So on the uh, Wi-Fi units, you know, it will create that Wi-Fi um, connection directly to the, uh, the receiver that's behind the display. And now it'll sit there and go, OK, I'm just an extension of you. I have all the smarts built in because I can talk to that device there and you're on your way. So it's not a matter of plugging it in and, and going to pick your peripherals or things like that. It's automatically going to grab what's been connected to the receiver behind the display. Sweet. 
Okay, so uh, recapping, um, we've got this new Air Media Connect dongle uh, announced uh, on stage Enterprise Connect with uh, Ilya today, uh, or depending on when you're watching this. Um, that is going to be shipping later in the year. This unit here, which does you know exactly the same thing, this is shipping uh, middle of April. Uh, and if you have either an existing Air Media or you want to buy an Air Media, you can connect this up. And not only can you share your desktop wirelessly without any drivers, um, you can actually then share the camera at the front of the room. I'm guessing there's lots of information on the Crestron website for people who want to find out more information about this, Laura. There is. We've got product pages that talk about the tech speeds and speeds. Um, we are. Uh, we just released a really awesome blog that really goes deep into the Microsoft relationship. Um, and then obviously, you know, the Air Media pages have all the information about Air Media. Fantastic. Very cool. Uh, Lauren, thank you for getting up and joining me on Crest TV for this uh, special announcement. I can't wait to start plugging this in and playing with this and talking to our customers about this. Um, thank you ever so much uh, for joining us today. Well, thank you. I love talking about this product. Cool. Very, very cool. And thank you all for tuning in to this exclusive product announcement here from Crest TV. The Air Media Connect dongle launched uh, with Microsoft, the Teams version launched with Microsoft. This version shipping middle of April. Uh, go to crestron.com, search for Air Media, find out more details on this. Hit the subscribe, ring the bell, do all that good stuff, and we'll catch you on the next Crest TV with lots of great updates from Crestron and the AV and UC industry. And I'll catch you on the next one.